It's supposed to be a moment What good is being the one When you the only one that knows it Hey man, it's the ISO God Sensei. Make sure y'all subscribe if you're new. Look, look, can you read? Can you read? It says, it says, subscribe with notice. Subscribe if you new. Click the goddamn bell. Hit the like button. Help a brother get in the algorithm. Help a young nigga out. Now look, I'm going to show y'all two builds. The best comp meta stage builds in the game my version of the best ones in the game for you little bots that like to do one finishing this is perfect for you this is the perfect one finishing for both of these goddamn builds one of them can have you know so make sure y'all y'all don't skip bro one of them's gonna be the straight offensive god the most offensive and speed power you can get and the other is gonna be a super offensive god with a lot of goddamn defense, you don't even need a lock. You can run lock yourself. You feel me? So, yeah. Anywho, let's get into it. So, with the position, we are going to go shooting guard. It is the best for this partic these particular builds that I'm going to show you. You know, uh, none of that none of that matters. We're going, we're going to go with this pie chart right here. The most OP pie chart in the game. <laughs> Then we're gonna go with the speed pie chart right here. So look at this, for you goddamn niggas with one finishing, you don't like finishing, you're not an ISO player, or you're just an ISO player that doesn't play comp, etc. I like for builds to have finishing. So that, that's why I'm gonna link down below the best play shot builds in the game, in my opinion, with goddamn nine finishing and all the fin all the shooting and playmaking badges you need but look so if you rock one finishing you can make your build look a whole lot better bro 25 shooting badges man you're a damn you're a sharp 99 three my nigga <laughs> all them damn playmaking and the defense and you're gonna have interior right you're gonna need that interior plus seven badges you know they try to baby you from the corner you're gonna be able to stop that nigga well, go rim protector bro so i mean even like with this build you're gonna be short right you stupid bitch this nigga ruining the video can, 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 can i get a ruin in the video in the comments but anywho i think this is the best for this little one bad shit that y'all are obsessed with I'm gonna go burly you're gonna appear even bigger you want to appear bigger I know y'all like that skinny shit because it makes your dribbling look better. Don't do it. Stop. Now look, we're going to go 6-1. I do not recommend going 6-3. I mean, don't. Hold on. I sound stupid as hell. I do not recommend going below 6-3. But look, this is the comp stage version. Your little dumb bot dickhead that likes to just run behind screens and throw up threes all day and all that type of shit and just stand in the corner they play d for you look this is you know if you don't want to go with it this is how you get 99 speed and 99 acceleration but um i'm sure a lot of comp stage guards probably switch to this hole but you get 99 speed and 99 acceleration and you're six one i don't i don't recommend this again but this is the comp stage, you know? <laughs> they like that type of shit. You're gonna go 165 weight. You're gonna do lowest wingspan. And then bam, sharp takeover, most brain dead takeover. Or you could do playmaking since you already gonna have all that crazy shooting. Um, niggas really try to check you, man. Like try to play you up high. You're gonna get those ankles. They like if, then if they start trying to hold their dick or spam square on you, it's gonna be easier for you to get the three. And if they try to double up, you got the big play. It's up to you. You know, you can make this vital, but this is just straight brain dead. You want to be toxic shit, all that type of shit, you know. But yeah. But you will definitely get some um, ankle breakers off of this because all niggas do on the stage is they just double you. That's all comp does, right? 
with these playmaking shit, you can put some niggas on the ground. You feel me? So, or um, stun them, OD, to like really catch them off guard. Not a lot of niggas use playmaking so the the stage guard locks ain't gonna be used to it. I'm telling you, you can you can make it work if you're a talented IQ nigga. But if you just a bot, go ahead, pick sharp. And by the way, the second build is a unique name. And we got the Allen Iverson build. Now I'm going to show you the best badges. And then I'm going to get into the second build, my boy. Hey, man. Rock contact. Consistent. Don't really matter, man. It's one goddamn badge. Or slithery. Hey, if you're going to be fading and shit, I would rock something like this. If not, maybe something like this. And I think you'd be. Uh, my nigga, you do not need dead eye in this game. I'm telling you, bro. But, um, yeah. Hey, man, if you're going to be playing behind screens and throwing oops, you could rock something like this. Um, bail out, you probably won't even need. You could do something like this. Or you want to be really toxic, do something like this. And um, just all that screenplay. And you be cool, bro. But if you're gonna be ISOing or something, you know, something like this would be cool. I think this would be the best. You know, you playing corner, shit like that. Of course, you gotta change it if you guard and ball. And yeah. Now for the second build, y'all put an eye down in the comments if um y'all made it to the second build, man. Drop a like on the video, subscribe if you know. You're gonna make him a shooting guard also, man. You're gonna go with the speed pie chart, my boy. Okay, so for a defensive play shot, right? A build that's gonna be able to guard ball, shoot lights out, just an all around build with this one finishing badge that y'all love. I think this is the best layout. Um, yeah. 10 defensive badges, bro. That height and everything else is going to help even more, bro. You really going to be unstoppable. Super ISO God, screen God, whatever. You're going to go burly. You're going to appear even bigger, right? Now, look. With pro dribble moves being implemented at 80, you don't got to make them 6'5", six, 6'4". Six, you know, you, you're not going to get 99 speed anyway, right? Make that nigga 6'6", six, six, nigga. Make that nigga 6'6", six, six, nigga. If you, look, 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 look. You gonna have Hall of Fame shooting, Hall of Fame playmaking, 10 defensive, all around build, bro. Big boy. Lowest weight, 180. And we gonna go max wingspan. So you're 6'6". Six, six. Max wingspan. Hall of Fame shooting. You gonna have high ass three. Speed boosting, curvy sliding, aggressive behind the back, speed glitching, and you go a defensive guy. And bam, you got lock take with it too. But look, here's the thing. Since you're not going to be able to have the 99-3 like the little midget play shots, you might as well pick sharp take. You're 6'6 six, six with max wingspan, 10 defensive badges. You don't need lock take. You could do it. You know, you could do it for the more of the defensive boost. But if you really want to um, even the balance out to make up for um, you not being a, being as short or as fast. And, you know, you still want to shoot God tier. Bam. Now you got a dog. You know, it's like it gives you playmaker vibes, like big playmaker vibes, big playmaker. Manu Ginobili! Hey, man, can we get a Manu Ginobili down in the comments, man? Can I, you know, Manu Ginobili, Ginobili, in the comments. And look, you a sharpshooting facilitator. Niggas ain't gonna know what you is, my nigga. I'm like, how's this nigga ISO and how is he doing this? How is he? Niggas ain't made this. Niggas ain't made this, nigga. Niggas ain't made this. I'm telling you, bro. Hey, if you got this bill, hit me on Twitter, man. I'm gonna make some vids with it. Hey, man, you could rock something like this with 22 badges. I think this would be lit. Stupid toxic. You don't need that eye again. 
This would be a nice lineup right here. If you don't need them pluckable like those, put that on needle. Niggas ain't gonna be stealing your passes. Voila. I'd run badges like this for a 10 badge. I think you'd be cool, my nigga. I ain't gonna hold you. And then if um run protector, you don't really need it on silver, go ahead and put that on interceptor or intimidator. Mm -mm. That's the end of the video, my boy. Make sure y'all follow me on Twitch. Subscribe if you're new. Hit that like button, man. Help me get recommended. Turn on post notes. I can't wait for next gen. I'm tired of playing this hoe. Y'all let me know if y'all tired of playing this hoe. Follow me on Twitch, Lord Baby Hulk. I'm gonna be streaming tonight. And um, yeah, y'all have a beautiful day. Drink a gallon of water a day.